everybody and welcome to another exciting installment of Wrestling Rampage. The two amigos are back in this bitch. That's right, we're back, Tommy. And our toilet's nice and clean. <laughs> and our toilet is nice and clean. Anyway, with that being said, uh, we... I wonder if he shits like a bear. <laughs> he might. <laughs> hey, if you want some shit, motherfucker, I'll give you some shit. <laughs> well, we know you will. You're damn right. <laughs> Just give you some Taco Bell and just wait, you know, huh? Fuck a Taco Bell, I'll shit in your toilet. Anyway, Tommy, we went to a couple of stores he today. He probably already got shit in his toilet. <laughs> the the, the, the minute men, men he, he, he sets on the toilet, they're shit. Hear me there, hear me there, thoroughbred. <laughs> Can we focus on that? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> we went to a couple of stores. Though. Yes, we did. We went to a couple of pawn shops. Yep. We went to Five Below. Yes, we do. We usually don't go there much. Not much, because there's not a lot of there. Not really. Much you know, there. it was pretty cool though. They yeah. they had some video games there. They had some five dollar video games. If there. I if I nothing, I was yeah, interested. If in. I had a PS Five, I would have got those NBAs. There was a P, they had they had a PS Five NBA game, which pretty cool that you can get like a for five bucks PS Five game now for like five bucks, but. I would pick it up if I had a PS5. Oh, yeah, but... Uh, but they didn't have no don't. PS4 games. Of course not. No, uh, no they did have one. Yeah, but it's it a shitty one. Yeah, it didn't seem that interesting. But, Tommy, we did we did find a few items yeah. at Five Below. What'd you get? Well, Five Below, for a whole whopping $5. Five dollars. As, uh, as Video Game XD, Jen and Charles will say, Tommy deal. Five dollar Tommy deal. <clears throat> I picked up a gaming headset. Gaming headset. As you can see, there's fucking a uh, whole bunch of fucking shit right there on the fucking side, and there's fucking shit on the side there. Rated G for gamers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's pretty cool. I bet you the young bucks would use these. <laughs> Probably so. Uh, this is actually a universal gaming headset. Yeah, it's you universal. Use it for, you can use it for almost any. And uh, I needed a backup headset. Yeah, and you didn't want to pay a lot of money for a backup. Fuck no, I don't want to pay a lot of money for a fucking backup. This is this is called the Unlocked brand, is what yep. the name of it is. Yep, and it was five bucks. Mm -hmm. It says it's universal, so it should probably work for my uh, for the high, PS4. High quality sound. Yep. Uh, extra soft ear cushions, flexible microphone, adjustable headband. Yeah, so it looks pretty good. So I was like, you know what? For five dollars, I do need a backup headset because. I, the other headset I had fell on the floor and now don't work. But I had another headset. But I needed a backup. So yeah. I wanted to get a backup. So this is the backup headset. I ain't going to use this yet. Not yet. So, but yeah, I got a backup headset for $5. I ain't going to complain. Cool. Uh, was that the only thing you got at uh, Five Below? Yeah, that was it. And then I bought That's something. That's all I picked up at Five Below. And then I bought something at Five Below. Just looking at the toys and games and stuff. Uh, I actually saw this and I was like, that might be sound. That, that actually might sound interesting to play. Yeah. Uh, it is Uno, but it's Mario Kart Uno. And uh, it was five bucks, as you can tell by the price tag. Yep. Uh, which is not bad for Uno for a brand new Uno set. That, that that's roughly what they go for. But uh, uh, this one supposedly has like a spin on it. You could use the items like bombs and um, mushrooms and thunderbolts and all that stuff in there. Um, it says right. It says right there, banana peel and the, and, the turtle shell. Yeah, and the turtle shell. You can use those in in the game uh, to like uh, you know one up on stuff. So I figured that might be awesome to play with Kahan when he comes over. Yeah, you know who else would love those? Who's that? The Super Smash Brothers. The Super Smash Brothers. Yeah. Oh yeah, they play it all the time on Pro Wrestling Gorilla. They do. P oh, PWG. You know, they sure do. But uh, I decided to pick this up because I figured my son might like it. Because you guys yeah. seen us play the uh, WWE Uno. Yeah, so I know. So I uh, figured to just uh, just to give it another twist, we'll, we'll I know try we'll, Mario Kart. I know he'll like it. Oh yeah, Caden loves board games and card games. Yeah, of course we got to play him every weekend. Yeah, every weekend. Let me tell you, gets boring sometimes. He wants to play. I some, snooze when it happens sometimes. Mostly Monopoly. I hate Monopoly. That's when I snooze. So I figured for five bucks I'll go ahead and snag this. He might he hell because uh, pops because pops likes Uno. I like Uno. Heck, heck. So he might I even, he, he might like I I even almost won Monopoly and I was asleep. <laughs> he was a, actually, actually you were asleep and you won. Remember? Yep. And King King goes, Papa, Uncle Tommy won. He did, he was he was asleep. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> King's like he was asleep, so that my chair should default him. I should be the winner. 
Well, it didn't work that way. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I decided to pick that up. Might, might be yeah, a fun that'll little, be something he'll get into. Fun little thing for for Caden uh, for Mario Kart. He he loves Mario Kart, and he likes Uno. So I figured, ah, uh, he might like to play yeah. that. Then Tommy, we went to the pawn shops. Yeah, we haven't went into the pawn shops a lot. There's reasons for that. Oh, now I know there's reasons, uh, and I'm uh, gonna complain here in a minute. <laughs> oh yeah, there's. Uh, uh, no, I'm really gonna complain. Um, like, mo, like, how many pawn shops did we go to? Like three, three or four, three three or four, four or something like that. Yeah. And honestly, they're pretty. Uh, it was a bust. Actually, except it for was one. A bust. Except it, for one. Well, I'm gonna still say that one was a bust too. And that one wasn't that great. I'll tell you why when I get to it. Why is that? Well, I'll... well, hold on. You did buy one item from one other store. Go ahead and show them the first. Well, one yeah, I have. did buy one item at this particular pawn shop. The rest was at another pawn shop. Yeah, the last pawn. Shop. I picked up on DVD for one dollar. One dollar. Joe Dirt Two. Joe Dirt Two. Did Charles just pick this up recently? Yeah, I think he I, did. I, I think he did. I picked it up for one fucking dollar. So. I don't know if it's good, so I was like, you know what? For a dollar, fuck it, I'll, I'll, I'll give it a try. David Spade. David Spade, Joe Dirt 2. Uh, it probably won't beat the first one, to be honest with you, probably. But. Yeah, uh, and the and Brittany Daniels hot fucking too. God she damn. sure is, ain't she? Good lord. But anyway, uh, <laughs> Christopher Walken's in it too. Oh, oh good lord, Dennis Miller. I'll get more ass than Mark McGrath is on there too. Yeah, but anyway... Joe Dirt 2. Yep. Joe Dirt 2 for a dollar. So dollar. I was like, you know what? Fuck it, I'll pick it up for oh, a Tommy. fucking dollar. So it's right there. A Crackle original movie. So you, so you know it's good that, that when it's on Crackle. <laughs> oh, this blows it out of the water then if you make it free <laughs> Crackle. Crackle. I know a lot about Crackle. Crackle. <laughs> I know a lot about Crackle. Oh, yeah. But anyway, but fuck a for, dollar for a dollar. I ain't gonna complain. So and most movies are like four or five bucks anyway. So yeah, I mean, so. he saved a little bit of money. Yeah, I've saved a little dab of money. But um, Tommy, you said you got some uh, issues at some pawn shops. What, yeah, I got some issues. What's going on? What's going well, on? Well, remember we went to the Trump pawn shop. Yeah, <laughs> there is a Trump pawn shop here. Yeah, there is. Mm -hmm. And you you can see Rambo right there. Rambo, Rambo Trump. Trump. <laughs> What about Rambo it? Trump. Okay. Who, who killed about 50 million cops at the state capitol. Uh -huh. Ain't that right, you fucking tan, fucking loose hair motherfucker. Fuck you, you fat bastard. <laughs> what about it? Well, we go there. Huh? They had some pretty decent games there. You gotta admit. A few. I went, I was looking at that Crash game. I uh, can't remember what fucking Crash game. It was for the PS4. Was it? Oh, was, was it the trilogy? Yeah. I believe it was the trilogy for the PS4. Yeah. And they wanted... What was it? Like fucking... 16 bucks? 16 fucking bucks. And you went on price charting. And I and I fucking wanted to see, what the fuck are these motherfucking Trumpers trying to do here? No, price charting. They had it for like, what, 13? Yeah. <laughs> they wanted 16 there? <laughs> yeah. Oh, you want to you wanna work out a couple $3? That's a, that's a Trumper for you. That's a Trumper for Any you. Any way to squeeze a little more money out of somebody. That's a Trumper for you. I was um, like, yeah, they ain't getting my goddamn money. So I left. I like pawn shops that have like basic prices for their games. I'm gonna be honest. Now they don't. <coughs> they don't. Uh, a lot. It of looks games. like you might as well just fucking go to a retro game store now. Yeah, you should. Here, here at our pawn shops. Yeah, our our local pawn shops. So guess store. what? From now on, that's what I'm gonna do. Fuck the pawn shops. And you know, uh, if I want DVDs, fuck, I'll I'll go there and then. And we went to a few. Like we went to, I think I think three or four pawn shops. Yeah. And besides you picking up that one at one pawn shop, there was nothing else there. No. Um. <clears throat> because they want the eBay prices yeah. for everything. So I was like... Same one where we went to today. Yeah. Uh, then we went to another one. And uh, I actually bought a, a, fl a few more stuff than Tommy did. Tommy only bought one more item there. But I will show you a couple things I did buy here before Tommy shows you his. Well, go ahead. <clears throat> I'll show you the one I took a loss on. Oh, you took a big <laughs> loss. <laughs> I'd, I've been wanting to try this game for a while now. You took a big loss on it. Uh, and it is... Uh, for the PS4, it's Cyberpunk 2077. Now I wanted to I wanted to get this because I figured you know because I, I I heard that they fixed it because it was it was really buggy and uh -huh. broken when they when it when it first got released. So I wanted to get it, see if I'd enjoy it or not. I did overpay a little bit for it. Oh, you sure did. Um, it's roughly around a fifteen dollar game. I paid twenty for it. Yep. Imagine that. 
But it does come with a bunch of stuff, though. I will say that. It comes with a, a slip cover. Uh, it comes with this um, like huge map poster thing. Um, then we got these uh, these like uh, cards, like a uh, what do they call those, like uh, postcards. Yeah. yeah, came with like a few postcards and stuff, and HBO Max and uh, little manual thing. Then we got the game inside here. <clears throat> oh, we got some stickers. Yep. <laughs> Uh, but, um, and then we got both discs. Yeah. So, it has everything in it, <clears throat> but I did overpay a few dollars for it, of course. Um, but, uh, I haven't found this game, uh, used anywhere else, which is kind of weird. But, so that's uh, why you yeah, so got I, it. So that's why I picked it up, but, um, did overpay a little bit for it, but is what it is. Well, I'm joining the clubs. So. Is what it is, yeah. Uh, well, yours was roughly what it, what 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 it goes for there. Uh, you want to show what you got, Jay? Uh, sure. Uh, sure will. The one item you bought. The one item, yeah. And here's the thing. I'm thinking if we ever had to pay for these prices, mm -hmm. you might as well go to a fucking game store. Yeah, you might as well go to a retro video game store if, if you're gonna pay this. Especially stuff. for that, mm -hmm. you might as well fucking go to a game store, which. That's what I'm going to do from now on. Yeah, from now on. Fuck pawn fuck, shops. Fuck pawn shops. Oh, unless you want this. I'm being honest. <laughs> yeah. For 10 bucks, I picked up for the PS4, Mafia 3. The 3? Oh, it is 3. Okay. Yeah, Mafia 3. It's actually made by 2K? Yeah, hmm. made by 2K. And it's complete. Oh, that's a thick Okay. Oh, you got like a little map thing or whatever. Yeah. I don't even know what the fuck that is. Oh, yeah. It's like a map. Yeah. Cool. And it comes with the manual. For what there is a one. Uh, yeah, what there is a one. And it comes with a disc. And the disc is in pretty good shape. Mm -hmm. So. Same thing but, with the Cyberpunk. And the yeah. Disc but, uh. I think the main reason why I picked this up, because one, I actually enjoy the Mafia games. I got some of those on PS3, so I actually enjoy the games. Yeah. And uh, and one, I don't really see this out. Yeah, yeah, you don't. Anywhere. Yeah, for some reason, you just never see it. So, that's why I was like, well, since it's here at a pawn shop, I'll get it. Didn't lose no money, didn't save no money either. Yeah, that's roughly what it goes for. Roughly what it goes for, so I was like, alright, I'll pick it up, fuck it. Mafia 3 for the PS4. And then I got four more items here that I'm going to show you guys. The the uh, first thing here is uh, a game I bought from GameStop, but yeah. was never shipped to me. Yeah. Uh, I guess Chase at the right price took them all, I guess. Uh, is that uh, shocked you? <laughs> I've seen that he sold like 25 or 30 of them. But and he low balls that we. And he low balls the Wii. For the Nintendo Switch, it does. They don't low ball the sports cards. <laughs> no. Chase after the sports cards. Right. Uh, Spyro United Trilogy. Uh, yeah. A, a game I've been wanting to get for a while. Paid roughly what it goes for. 25 bucks. Yeah. Um, but uh, I seen it there. I was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and snag it. Yeah. Snag um, it. No little, no manual or nothing. Just, just the There's game a, case. There it is. There's the. So, so I had to pick that up for roughly what Crash it goes Bandicoot. for. Here's Crash Bandicoot. Yeah. Uh, it has Crash 1, uh, Crash 2, and Crash 3. Yeah. Which I have Crash two on the PS1. But that's all that's the only crash game yeah. I have. So so I had to pick that up. Um then the only game I actually did get a get uh and well hold on here before, before we get started on that let's go show, show them this since I show them the, the other thing. I actually got a PS4 controller. Yep. Um I don't know if you guys know but controllers, especially for the newer systems, are getting harder to find. Yeah. Uh PS4 Fives, PS4s, uh, Xbox hell, Ones. Hell, even PS3s. PS3 uh, controllers are getting a little harder to find. Uh, f around here, at least. Yeah. Um, like, you, like we don't even find them in... <clears throat> if we do find them in retro video game stores... They, want, armor, they want a lot of money. They, like, they want like 50, 60 bucks for them. Uh, which, that's outrageous for, for a used controller. So, yeah, if, you want, <laughs> if you're going to pay that price, you might as well get it new. Or, or go on eBay. Yeah. Um, well, I didn't pay a bunch for this, but I didn't pay, uh, uh, you know, very cheap for them either. But yeah. uh, PS4 controller, 
Uh, I have multiple cords for these because I because I actually buy yeah. some chargers in bulk for them. Because they're pretty cheap. Because they're cheap and pops messes up every goddamn oh, yeah. like couple of months or whatever. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so I decided to buy. Oh, he goes through cords more than I do. <laughs> yeah, he does, doesn't he? Look at look at him sleeping over there. I anyway. <laughs> I ain't sleeping. Yeah, he was. Anyway, he was. I saw the drool. Uh, I bought this PS4 controller because I Holy wanted. I, I I wanted another controller because yeah. For my systems, I like to have anywhere from three to four controllers for each system I have, just in case something goes wrong. So I decided to buy another controller for the PS4. I got it for forty dollars. Forty bucks. Which is not bad for a nah for a PS4 controller. Um. Then, uh, if you guys watched one of our, well, one of the recent, um, one of the recent Facebook Marketplace deals, I just bought an Xbox One. Uh-huh. So, uh, it's the, uh, it's the Halo Edition Xbox One. Uh-huh. And I decided that with this Xbox One, I'm going to buy Xbox exclusive games. So, no, uh, no, uh. No other game, just Xbox yeah. exclusive games. Just Xbox exclusive games on this Xbox. I don't want any other like game that could be on the PS4, PS4 or Switch or anything like that. So I'm just buying straight exclusives for my Xbox One. And I found one at the pawn shop. Uh, for the Xbox One, uh, an exclusive Forza Horizon 2. Um, it says, uh, leave your limits. Uh, the next uh, game uh, is the best-selling gaming, well, racing franchise on the Xbox One. Uh, it looks awesome. I'll be honest with you. And uh, looks like they have the uh, Back to the Future car there. Yeah. Well, actually, that's more of just a Lamborghini in general. Uh, but um, I actually got this for twelve dollars, which is this is actually one I saved the most on. This game is around a $20 game. Yeah. Uh, and I got it for 12 bucks. So I actually saved a little bit on this Yes, you one. did. Uh, unfortunately, the uh, the case does You're not... You're going to have to uh, get a new case. Which I have extra cases. The, yeah. the case does not close at all. It, it's <laughs> it's yeah. not closed at all. But uh, I do have extra Xbox One cases. So I'll just swap it out with a, yeah. with like a sports game or there whatever. You and uh, I'll have a case there on that one. And then the last item I picked up is a... Xbox One controller because I only have one controller for the Xbox One. It's that Halo Edition yeah. one, and I really don't want to use that controller very often. I'd rather use like a like a regular controller. And I found this one sitting there. It is a red Xbox One controller. Uh, it feels pretty good in the hands. I'll be honest with you. Um, He's gonna be wanting that one. Yeah, he'll, uh, my son might be one to play with this one mostly because he 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 loves he loves the color red. So. Uh, but I picked this up because I was like, you know what? I need another Xbox One controller. Uh, these do take batteries, which there are batteries in it right now. Um, I will be taking these batteries out because I do not want it to get corroded in there. So uh, that's the one bad thing about Xbox is they do... Take batteries. They take batteries where the PS4... That's why I like the PS4. But the PS4 is it's a charger cable. Which it's, is way it's, better. It's a rechargeable battery. And I'll be on, And to be honest, I like the charger batteries better. Agreed. But uh, I also picked this one up for $40 as well. Uh, roughly what they go for. That, that's roughly... You know, these may go for like 50 or so on eBay. So I saved a little bit on there on these controllers. But I definitely wanted to get another Xbox yeah. One controller. Because I, I like to have multiple controllers with my systems. That's just the way I am because I like to... I don't, I don't like for a controller to break. Yeah. And then I just don't have any, any other controller. J just for reference. Because I actually have had a few controllers just go out on me that I can't, I, w I wouldn't be able to fix. Yeah. And it sucks cause that you have to try to go find a new one or whatever. So I decided to pick one up when I had the opportunity. So that's what we picked up at the pawn shops and five below. Nothing fantastic here, but... Mm -hmm. Uh, pay, pay, well, I, I, I paid a shitload, you didn't pay a shitload. No. You paid, what, what, uh... A dollar, five dollars, and ten dollars. So, sixteen. I paid forty, uh, sorry, eighty, a hundred, hundred and twenty-five, hundred and thirty, uh, and a hundred and forty-two. That's how much I paid, a hundred and forty-two dollars. But it is what it is, um... I don't. I don't find. I don't. I don't find like current or X. Well, left last gen controllers yeah. that often in the wild. I just don't. Um, 
and they seem fine. They don't seem like any of the buttons are sticking or um, anything's wrong with these controllers. So they should play fine as, yeah. the, old, as the old man's eyeball on that PS4 controller. Even uh, though he has a million of them. Even, even though the motherfucker has like four of them. But, because uh, it will. You had to skip it. Ugh, skip it! Yeah, <laughs> anyway, we hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to share it all over social media. Like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash Russell Rampage 2. You can also follow us on Twitter at Russell Rampage. You can also add us on Facebook as well. You can also follow us on Instagram. Instagram. Uh, and guys, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button for more great videos coming to you guys because we're that cream that rises to the top. Cream of the crop, and nobody does it better.